Hey friends, I thought it would be fun to do a little science this week. So I got out my fancy lab coat and I thought about what will be a fun thing to do. Well, we're talking about the ocean and there are things, ocean is a big body of water, right? And things are at the bottom of the ocean. They sink down to the bottom and there are things like boats that float up at the top of the ocean. So I thought it might be fun to do some sink or float experiments. Now, a prediction is a good guess about what will happen. And that's the kind of thing scientists do. They predict what might happen and then they observe. So they use their good eyes to see what happens. And then they decide if their prediction was right or wrong. So you guys are gonna help me with that a little bit, okay? I'm gonna turn my camera and we are, oh, going to look. What do I have here? A tub of water. And I also have a few different objects that we're gonna put in the water and we're gonna make a prediction about whether it's going to sink or if it's going to float. The first thing I have is a rubber duck, just like you might have in the bathtub. Now, if you've ever had a rubber duck in your bathtub, what does that duck do? Does it float in the bathtub with you? It does, so I'm going to make a prediction that this duck is going to float in my container of water here, so let's see. Oh, I was right. All right, I'm observing with my eyes. He is floating along happily. Okay, so let's try something else. I have a fish, and it is a hard plastic fish. What do you think? I'm gonna predict that this guy's going to sink. What do you think? Let's try it and see. Oh! He's floating. Check that out, look at that. Well, I'm using my observation skills and I see that I was wrong. That fish is floating. Now I have a key. It's just like a hard metal key, just like your parents used to open up the door. So what do you think? Sink or float, you make a guess and then I'm gonna put it in the water and we'll see what happens. Whoa, do you see that? That key, that key sunk down to the bottom. There it is, down at the bottom of the water. It's kind of hard to tell, look in here, if it's sinking or floating, isn't it? Okay, but we saw it, it is down at the bottom. How about a boat? Now, usually we see boats floating on top of the water, so I'm gonna guess. Look, there it goes. It's a little lopsided. Maybe it's not a boat that you might wanna go for a ride on, but it is floating. Okay, now what about this seashell? What do you think? Do you wanna take a guess what it's gonna do? Now put it in here and let's see what happens. Whoa, did you see the splash? Can you tell that it's on the bottom? It sunk down into the water. This is down there next to the key. Okay, I have this little foam cube. Little, not really a cube, it's a square. All right, let's put it in and see. What are you, are you gonna guess? I'm gonna guess float because it's a very lightweight foam. So let's see. Oh, yep. Yeah. It's just floating along with the boat and the fish and the duck. How about this little piece of wood? Let's try this. It is floating. When you think about it, a lot of a lot of times you might see some wood floating in the, in the water. It doesn't sink all the way down to the bottom. Um, I have a button. Let's see what this button does. Oh, that was interesting. 
it's it's floated for just a minute and then it very slowly sank to the bottom all right okay now i have a little foam cube so we have the wood cube that's floating what do you think about this guy let's put it in and see oh it is definitely floating i wonder if it gets all the way wet what it will do do you think that'll make it do something different? Nope. Still even wet or dry. It is still floating. Sometimes it floats a little bit below the water. Sometimes it floats way up on the top, but it is not sinking down to the bottom. Now, what do you think about this? It's a metal cube and it's pretty heavy and it seems pretty solid so let's see whoa that sunk with a splash that went crashing down to the bottom okay so think about which one of your predictions were correct this one sunk the metal key sunk and so did the shell but all these other things floated I think you guys did a great job with this. I'm glad, I love science. It's one of my favorite things. So I was happy to put on my lab coat and get to work with you guys. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Bye. Mwah.